Yeah, let's get this real quick. Let's get this real quick. Actually. Okay. Shalom, you have by Shimia Shai. Brakadai, you have a brakadai. I was shy. Brakadam to the Akimwa. Akim out there keeping his word, truth, and all sincerity. Teaching downfall Esau, the two thirds wicked queendom and these heathens. To the hopeful elect, 144,000 men that's out here guarding his truth and is fighting for this kingdom. To the uh, Habai of Shah Dawadah, the house of David, to uh, to the one third men, women, and children that's seeking and guarding his truth as well, to the best of their abilities. Clown Yashallah, rise Israel, Lam Lam Young. Um, now, I just want to go over to let you know because a lot of people think that uh, that these kids and babies are, you know, they're going to be okay. And it says that in the Bible that only a man of the Lord's kids is going to be okay. Okay. So this is 1 Samuel 15 and 3. Now go and smite Amaclach, even though this is talking about Amaclach, and utterly destroy all they that have spared them not, but slay both man, woman, infant, and suckling, ox, sheep, camel, and ass. Now what they're saying that's talking about Amalek. That's talking about those fake Zionists over there that are over in the in Israel saying that they're the Jews. It's talking about, you know, there's nothing new under the sun. What has basically what was done shall be done again. So the Bible says you can't if you walk, you know, hand in hand with somebody, then you in agreement, you know. So and it also says if you defend an abomination, then you are an abomination. So if you just say, oh, it's not bothering me that, you know, there's gays and all kinds of stuff and whatever, then you're in agreement with the, uh, you're in agreement with the devil. So that means that you Satan, you know, you're an adversary of the most high, you have by Shimei Shai. An adversary means to be against, an opponent. So you Satan, you the devil, you're a two-third. So this is 1 Corinthians 11. But I will have you know that the head of every man, hold on, this ain't, this is not the verse that I'm looking for. Uh, here we go. This is Ezekiel's 9 and 6. Slay utterly old and young, both maids and little children. And little children, so you're not safe. And woman, but come not near any man, any man, any man whom is the mark. Okay, let's get this. Okay, this is Acts 16 and 31. And they said, Believe on the Lord Jesus Christ, Yahweh Shai Hamashiach, and thou shalt be saved in thy house. So, any man, any man, any man upon whom is the mark, and begin, and begin at the sanctuary. At begin at my sanctuary. How many times does he tell you? Begin at his sanctuary. Watch this.
Oh, yeah, that don't make sense. First Peter 4 and 17. For the time has come that judgment must begin at the house of what? God. Yahweh. Okay, so make sure you're in order. Begin at my sanctuary. Where's your sanctuary? His house. The house of God. Yahweh. Then they begin at the ancient men, which were before the house, which were before the house, which were before the house. At the first begin at us and shall end be of them that obey not the gospel of God. Yahweh. Okay. So for all y'all that be like, oh, I'm saved. No, the fuck you're not. The only time you're going to be saved is when you're on a chariot. You're not following the orders. You're not, you're not listening. Okay. Once again, you women need to get under a man of the Lord. A man shall be a hiding place. It don't say a woman. It says a man shall be a hiding place from the wind and a cover from the tempest as a river of water in a dry place as a shadow of great of a great rock in a weary land. Plain out and simple. So just to let you know you be like, oh but I'm under his house. Okay. His child shall not see hell, right? Let's go ahead and see it. This is for the men of the Lord. So the ones that are in his house, second Ezra 2 and 29, my hand shall cover thee so that thy children, thy children shall not see hell. Right? Okay. So who's not going to see hell? Thy children of the man of the Lord. And it says, slay utterly old and young both maids both maids and little and children and women so you are not saved so when y'all be like oh that's a woman you shouldn't hit her fuck that you hit me i'm smashing you if the most high gonna hit you i'm gonna hit you don't hit me keep your hands off me deputies are searching for whoever shot and killed a 10-year-old boy. And it happened as that boy was riding in a car with his family. NBC 4's Tony Guignard live at that scene with what detectives know so far. Tony. Uh, good morning, Adrian and Daniela. I've learned that the child, the victim, was actually one of two children riding in the car when someone took shots at that family. It happened uh, just before 9.45 last night here. At That's it. I ain't gonna go too much into detail on that. But that just lets you know that that happened seven hours ago, that this is not a joke. The Most High is not playing, you know. And for you guys that be crying about Kobe Bryant and everybody else, he say let the dead worry about the dead. So either you're going to get down or you're going to get laid down. Remember, he say, Who, he say whoever don't love me harms himself. You know, basically you hurt yourself because you want to sin, you know, because he says who are, whoever sin against him wrong is his own soul you know what i mean not your life your soul because you mess your soul up because whoever don't love him loves death so if you love death you love death man that's the way you just said so with that said shalom